So this is how uh, we decorate the plate. So we keep uh, leaves and then uh, bananas. So mostly that's uh, in our traditional plates. You can see bananas and then we're adding pongal. So with the pongal, uh, we did uh, a sweet, uh, I mean, it's uh, kesari. So then we offer it to God. Yeah, happy Thai pongal. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. So today we are celebrating Thai Pongal. So wishing you all a very happy Thai Pongal on behalf of my family to you all. So, uh, so today I'm doing uh, this video to show you how I celebrate Pongal. Uh, because many of my friends like from other religion they used to ask me like how I celebrate Pongal. So this is how we do. So we make Pongal and some other sweets. Um, and then banana and this. We offer it to sun. And we make a little prayer like we will show uh, some prayers so that's what we do so i'll keep it aside because it's too hot and oh it was uh cloudy earlier but it's now the sun is popping out so it's too warm here so yeah so why do we celebrate pongal so the actual thing is it's uh the celebration for farmers so it's farmers festival so basically uh the, before the pongal day there is another one called pohi pongal so in this Pohi Pongal, what they do is, uh, it's not celebrated by us. So basically, uh, the motive of that one is to get rid of the past. So normally what they do is they put their clothes, like old clothes on fire and like getting rid of the past and coming up with some new. Uh, so that's the motive of that one. And then the Pongal. So on the Thai Pongal day, it's actually for farmers as I said earlier. So what they do is uh, they thank sun on this day because uh, for them to get the harvest from their paddy fields uh, so the sun and rain they help uh, if not um, in, according to the special time which they need if not uh, it won't be a good time so they can't get their harvest on proper time so for that in a thanking way they show their greetings as it so what they do is from the harvest they uh, got from that uh, this january so normally they harvest uh, the paddy from uh, the, in this january period so they get that rice so the amount of rice that they want and they make pongal on that and then they offer it to sun on this day so you can celebrate it in as you want like normally uh, here in um, a village we can do it but now here we live in apartment so in my uh, in my case like i live in apartment so what i do is i uh, we make some sweets actually my mother do it so we make uh, pongal and some sweets and we offer uh, we keep it in a plate arrange it like this and we offer it to sun and we have a little prayer that's it so that's about pongal and then the next day after the pongal day it's party pongal it's for the ox or bull so you might have seen in movies like to plow the uh, field they use ox or bull so for helping them in that they help ox or bull sorry <laughs> bull on uh, this way so what they do is uh, they decorate like uh, they give a good path to them uh, they decorate them they put uh, garlands of flowers on them uh, so it will be like a very um, pretty one like they will make them pretty and then they will make the same pongal and offer it to them so it's their way of greeting to those uh, ox and bull for helping them for their cultivation so this is the brief thing uh, why we celebrate pongal so yeah i think it's done so it's uh, yes i know most of them uh, like hindus uh, might know about this but uh, other people might not know so yeah i think you will got to know how we celebrate pongal and why so yeah it's time for me to uh, start eating my uh, pongal and sweets so see you on next video before that subscribe to my channel and click on the bell button for more updates bye bye